Graham Foster. I mean, it's a lovely little run around. One careful owner, which always helps. I mean, it's a perfect first car. This is your first car, and it is a very good choice. Both my daughters learned to drive in something like this. It's what you want, ain't it? Reasonable price and not too much stress. Got any questions? But yeah, yeah. You, you've got daughters. What? Look, I'm, I'm not actually here to buy the car. I ain't giving you the key, son. And I ain't carrying cash. So it looks like you and me both had a waste of time, no, don't no, it? No, 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 that's, that's, that's not it. I'm not a mug or anything. I'm Freddy. You're like a Freddy Slater. You, you're my dad, ain't you? I guess your mum's given her side of the story. One of them sisters. No. No one says a word about you ever. That it's taken me this long just to find out what your name is. Well, guess that shows initiative. Checking me out before you showed your hand. Make a good salesman. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a good salesman. Really good salesman, actually. Fish and chips at the minute with my mate Bob, but. You know, I've got plans. You don't go nowhere without dreaming big. <laughs> I say that all the time. <laughs> <laughs> so, what happened, Dad? Oh, I don't know yet. I've often asked myself the same question. When I last saw you, you was in a pram. You and me. We paid a high price, didn't we? You seemed like a good lad. And I've learned getting bitten takes you nowhere. I ain't denying it all got very complicated in the end, Fred. Well, you'll know. Your mum ain't quite as quiet as she makes out. <laughs> she gets something in her head and there's no shift in her. Look, this is a conversation to be had over dinner and a couple of beers, not sat out here in the street. Unless. Got time for that test drive? 